you, or you might want to sit down for this because Costco is officially changing out the churro for a double chocolate chunk. So quick update, Costco took my membership card. Come here. Reason why was because a while back I tried to get their mac and cheese and then when I tried to pay for it, they looked at my membership card and they didn't think it was me because I didn't have my beard in my membership picture. So they made me put the mac and cheese back. So I did what any reasonable person would do. Um, I shared the recipe with everybody so that they can just make it at home. Uh, well, Costco wasn't too happy about that because when I went back, the same cashier uh, was giving me a hard time about my membership card and I said, you know what? Just keep it. Keep the card because I want you to know exactly who keeps sharing these recipes since you guys want to give me such a tough time. So then I shared with everybody how to make their churros. Um, well, it's been some time and I think Costco thinks that everything is all good because that same cashier messaged me saying, hey, hope you had a great holiday. Get closer. Who wants to make cookies? One cup of salted butter, a cup of brown sugar, a half cup of regular sugar, two eggs, a third cup of corn syrup, one tablespoon of molasses, a half teaspoon of vanilla extract, three and a half cups of flour, a half teaspoon of salt, a half teaspoon of baking soda, and one and a half cups of chocolate chunks. And then preheat the oven to 350 degrees, cook for 11 minutes. You now have a Costco chocolate chunk cookie you can make at home. Uh, have fun.